Hey, what's going on guys? My name is Blaze Killing. Today we are back with another video. In today's video, we are at a really interesting point. At the time of recording this video, the Halloween update still has not been released. And this is pretty unheard of, uh, at least in the terms of the history of these Halloween updates. In the past, we've seen these updates come out on October 1st, October 2nd, September 30th, as early as September 26th, I believe. But nothing as late as this. At the time of recording this video the update has not been released it's possible that the update has come out by now but in any case i would like to give you all some uh, halloween predictions even if the update has uh, been released some items have been released that's not definitive that no other items will be released as part of the update so i think this video still holds relevance whether or not the update has come out already at the time of you watching this so i would like to make a video today talking about my predictions for the halloween uh, update and, and not just the update but specifically with regard to what's going to be added and the presents the gifts the items that are going to be added to the shops so if we look back into previous updates we're going to see that we have a pumpkin every single halloween event we all know that right we also have some different uh, other items recently we've been we've been uh, gifted different bags of candy but also in the past we've seen axes we've seen paintings and, and we've seen some other things like the ostrich eye like the skull like the lone cave the lost cave and i would like to speculate today on, on what some other things might be that we uh, could see first let's begin with the obvious let's begin with the pumpkin so in the past we've seen the red pumpkin we've seen purple pumpkins we've seen the green the maroon like the dark red pumpkin we've seen the, the wooden pumpkin i think it was called the lumpkin if i'm not mistaken uh, we've seen like a, a, a dark white kind of grayish pumpkin we've seen pink light blue dark blue but w what's missing from those we haven't seen a black one we haven't seen a, a bright white one we haven't seen an orange one or a yellow one you could argue that the reddish ones are kind of that but you know so there, you definitely have some more options in terms of, of pumpkin varieties in order that this video is not terribly long let's just jump straight to uh another category so if i were to predict a pumpkin i would say yellow orange some black or white something we haven't seen yet or maybe some variant uh, a lighter or darker variant of what we've seen previously so here i am in bob shack this is where the items the pumpkin specifically would normally be added right here and again at the time of this recording there's no pumpkins currently here but this is where they would be just so you all can tell um just so you all can can know and be prepared for that let's jump now into the bags of candy in the past we've seen blue green purple gold and then the normal bag of candy that's uncolored well it has a color it's like orange slash brownish uh, in color but what's missing from that we, we're missing a lot of colors we don't we don't have red we don't have uh yellow pink black silver we don't have really an orange one so we can totally be, be seeing any of those color variants uh more than those variants though it's going to be interesting to see what uh, candy bars are actually contained within those bags of candy. Uh, we've seen a lot of them in the past. How many can Defaultio cook up? How many puns, <laughs> candy puns, uh, Lumber Tycoon candy puns can Defaultio uh, kind of cook up for us? We'll see. Uh, in terms of decorations, though, I want to jump into this new category. In the past, we have seen the spooky icicle lights, specifically is the main decoration that I'm thinking of. I can pull this up for you. I don't think I have any up right now. Maybe I'll have to put some up with this, the spooky icicle lights. But what if we had some other types of lights that were like maybe bats or skeletons or spider webs or like some ghosts or something like that? More than that, what if we had some other types of decorations that were added? These decorations are typically added in the fancy furnishing shop, just so you are aware if he does add anything else uh, decoration wise to this update. We have the broomstick maybe that could be added or like here's a really interesting one you know how we have the floodlight we have uh it's right here i believe the work light yeah what if we ha he added a like a lantern like a haunted lantern or some sort some sort of other light that is halloween themed i think that would super, be super cool especially if it had some utility in terms of actually producing light and being useful what if he added spider webs or something of that sort i don't know just just some predictions and, and just some ideas to get you thinking let me know if you have uh, if you agree with any of those in uh, the comments below. Now let's talk about axes. Axes. So in the past, Default 2 has released a few axes as part of the Halloween update. So specifically, he's added the Amber Axe right here. And he's also added one more axe. Uh, I'm trying to think what that axe is right now. I think it's the, the, candy cor the Candy Corn Axe. Do I have that? Right here. Yeah, the Candy Corn Axe. Oh, that's a pumpkin. Never mind. I don't know if I have the Candy Corn unless I'm blind. You guys can totally get mad at me. Or is this the Amber Axe? Y'all, 
that's the this is the blue steel. You guys have you guys are gonna have to forgive me here. This is the Ember X. Uh, then the pump. Uh, what, did, what did I say? The Candy Corn X. Yeah, this is elsewhere. I think it might be in this here. But in any case, if it's not, he's added a couple axes in the past. You guys get the point. What could be added in terms of an axe in the future? Well, what about like a Vampire Fang axe? Or I think a Vampire Fang axe would be kind of cool because it would just be like a retextured version of uh, a current axe that has kind of ice. Like, what about the? Isn't there an axe that has some uh, icicles coming out of it? Like the the frost axe, right? What if it was just retextured instead of frost icicles? They were vampire fangs. I don't know. What about like a ghostly axe or a shadow axe or something like that? That would be uh, super cool. What would they cut well? I don't know. Maybe spook and sinister wood. But then again. Finding those woods in the first place is pretty difficult, so I don't know. Okay, now I want to jump into the final, or maybe penultimate category here, which is paintings. In the past, we've seen a few paintings, but what's really strange about these paintings that have been added in previous Halloween events is that they don't seem to have much relevance to anything Halloween related. What I mean by that is what's been added in the past. We've seen the pineapple painting. Remember that famous painting that's worth, uh, I forget how much money, but a lot of money, the most expensive painting in the game, I believe. The Arctic Light painting, which is kind of hinting at the uh, the Frostwood, I believe. And then we, we've seen a Halloween type, I guess, of uh, painting, I take that back. It was the Gloomy Seascape at Dusk painting. I'll try to supplement you all with some pictures on the screen so you can see. That was that was more of a spooky, a spooky one. Uh, but what if we saw some other ones? Like, I'm, I'm trying to think Lumber Tycoon related here. Maybe a painting of a Spook and Sinister Wood, or a painting of the Lone Cave, the Lost Cave, the Maze, things that are dark and spooky kind of in nature. Uh, what if we see also like a, a, a painting of the Swamp? You know, I'm, I'm trying to th think in terms of Lumber Tycoon because recently in this past Christmas event, we saw, um, what, what was it? The, the Lava Tree, right? That was a painting. So I don't know, j just an option. Maybe we can see something less Lumber Tycoon related, like a cemetery or a haunted forest, pumpkin patch, or something like that. I'm not 100% certain. All right, I said that was going to be the second to last category because I think there is this one last category that Defaultio could uh, could engage with, could, could uh, be involved with, which is like the random category, I want to call it. Because in the Judas patch, if you all remember that, at 2022, I believe it was, the a few things were added specifically actually where I am right now. Well, one thing here, the question mark, question mark, question mark item was added about right here, I believe. And that still serves no purpose as far as anyone can tell. Also, what was added during that time was the Mary statue also around here, a little bit facing that direction outside of the, the fancy furnishing store. Underground is where that statue was added. So there's some, some really strange things that were added in the past, that things that aren't related to a painting some, or decoration, Things that aren't related to an axe or to a pumpkin or a bag of candy or anything like that. Like the lone cave or the lost cave or the eye or the skull, uh, the, the strange man, the, 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 you know, things like that. Where there's a new biome added, there's a new activity that can be uh, engaged with, you know. And I think an interesting location where we might see that happen here is right here. The location of the egg hunt. Right? There's still some indentation here. I'm not saying that there is the indentation because there's something that's going to be added in the future, but why not take advantage of the space that you've already hollowed out, Defaultio, to make it a new biome of sorts? Is there is enough space in here for a new biome with a new tree or a new shop or something? I don't know. I don't know if Defaultio is going to go that big uh, or if Defaultio is even going to get an update in the first place this Halloween event. I, I'm slightly joking because I really hope he does. Uh, but given that no updates come out at least yet, I'm, I'm starting to wonder. But possibly it's the case that an update has come out by the time I'm uploading this video. But those are some Halloween predictions. I more or less gave you some ideas of what could be added in the future because of what we've seen in the past. But again, Defaultio is unpredictable. It's difficult to, to predict what he's going to add. Like one Christmas event he added a, a, tra a traffic cone, right? How do you predict that? How do you predict that? <laughs> Okay, um, hopefully you enjoyed this video get in, and it got you thinking. Leave in the comments below if you agree with any of these predictions or ideas or what else you would like to see added to this game uh, during this Halloween event. I'll be, of course, the hopefully the first or one of the first to update you when the update does come out in the first place. And I'll be the first to update you on all Lumber Tycoon things more generally. So in order to receive those notifications, put the bell on uh, so that you'll, you'll be the first to see those videos when they come out. Other than that, like, comment, subscribe. I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace out.